Hello everybody, Drew from Langlois Vital Nutrition here, and I'm talking to you today about the most popular vitamin, the most requested vitamin of 2019. And you can probably guess already, I'm talking about vitamin D. The first time that vitamin D started to get really, really popular, don't know if you remember this, Oprah spoke about it. It was at a point in time where Oprah would gain weight, and then lose weight, and then gain weight, and then lose weight. Finally, she started to work with some kind of specialist who diagnosed her with a thyroid condition and said that part of her thyroid condition was related to a lack of vitamin D. So, all of a sudden, Oprah started to maintain this healthy weight. She started to have more energy. And that's when she started to talk about health on her show more than ever before because she had found something that was working for her health. Vitamin D is crucial for calcium usage. So often we hear that vitamin D is very important for bone health. And that's because we can't have healthy bones unless our body is using calcium the right way. We also hear that vitamin D is very important for immune health. And that is also actually because of the way vitamin D helps our body use calcium. Calcium is one of the most important nutrients to make sure that an immune system can attack invaders. And then we also know that vitamin D is called the sunshine vitamin and that it helps us with our mood. And believe it or not, that also has to do with the calcium. Because when our body is using calcium the right way, our body can soothe itself, it can calm down, and that can keep us away from things like anxiety. Now there's something really important about vitamin D, because if I just keep calling it vitamin D, you might go out and accidentally get the wrong kind of vitamin D. I want to make sure that you get vitamin D3 and not vitamin D2. This is a very important difference here. It's the difference between a plant source of vitamin D and an animal source of vitamin D. Vitamin D2 is not what you want. It's called ergocalciferol. If you see the word ergocalciferol on your vitamin supplement, don't get it. That's the type of vitamin D that naturally occurs in plants and even grass. Now for a body to process vitamin D2 into something it can use as a mammal, like humans are, it's gonna need four stomachs. And right now you're thinking to myself like, Drew, there's no way that I have four stomachs. And you're right, cows have a bunch of stomachs and chickens have a bunch of stomachs. So they can eat grass and they can eat different plants and convert that vitamin D2 into usable vitamin D3. Now for the rest of us who don't have multiple stomachs, we're gonna to wanna to look for a vitamin D supplement that says D3 on it. The word we're looking for is cola calciferol. Cola calciferol is the type of vitamin D we want. So in all of 2019, we had all these requests for vitamin D and we really took time to educate people on the difference between vitamin D2, which is ergocalciferol and useless for humans, and vitamin D3, which is cola calciferol and is the right source for vitamin D. Thank you so much for watching this. I look forward to all of your questions. And you can also look forward to some more videos on the Year in Nutrition 2019 coming your way. Have a great day.